I get up every morning at around 6 o'clock to get ready and face the day. This includes putting on my uniform, cleaning my face, brushing my hair, brushing my teeth, and just fully waking up in general. I usually only put on a light makeup for school, which includes foundation, as you see me putting on here, some highlighter, And then I always set my makeup so that it doesn't get all messy during the day because I am quite active. Not with sports, but with walking around the hallways and running into people all the time. I also put on my contour so that I have a little bit more shape to my face. And then I put on mascara and that's about all I do for makeup. downstairs and make sure that all of my bags are packed and ready to go. I have two bags that I usually need to pack, which includes my theater bag, which is shown here, which is just a Jansport backpack, which I decorated a little bit with my theater company. Then I also have my regular school backpack, which has all my books and school materials in it, of course. My cat also requires lots of cuddles and petting in the morning because he's always really depressed when we leave and it's kind of sad and adorable at the same time. I'm usually on the road to school by 7 o'clock because I need to pick up my carpool and get to school on time. It takes me about half an hour to get to school, which includes picking up my carpool. and. That usually means that I get to school around 7.20 to 7.30, depending on when I leave and traffic and all the logistics, but around 7.20-ish. So my school starts at 8.20, 8 but I like to get to school early so that I can hang out with my friends and do any extra homework that I didn't finish the night before. It's really nice to have the extra hour before school starts just to do whatever I need to do and get ready for the day. School is then over at 3.20, and that usually means that I'm on my way to rehearsal. On this day, my boyfriend picked me up so we got Starbucks, but that's not a normal occurrence. Here I am just walking into my theater company. I didn't want to show too many things. This is a clip of me getting ready for rehearsal. <laughs> hard time getting my character shoes buckled. I'm not sure if that's just me or my shoes, but if you have the same problem, comment down below so I don't feel as alone. It always takes me a really long time to get these things to work. at 9 o'clock which means that I'm out of the rehearsal room at around 9.15 because I have to put away my costume and make sure that everything is nice and orderly backstage and I tend to talk with my friends a few minutes before they leave as well. Rehearsal nights get pretty long so my family usually has something for dinner before I get home so when I do get home myself I just need to find something in the fridge that resembles dinner and make sure that I have enough for the night. This night I found some leftover tortellini from the last night's dinner and I just decided to make myself a bowl of that with some cheese just to keep myself nourished and healthy. Then I 
take a shower and put some styling mousse in my hair so that my hairstylist can work with it the next day. He likes to make sure that we put our styling mousse in the night before so that it has time to work itself into our hair so that it's much easier for her to combat the next day. I also like to stretch my feet at night just to make sure that they don't get stiff and that they're always healthy and fit for dancing and they don't get cramped up when I need them the most. I really like doing this after I've showered or taken a bath because they're nice and soft and they're not as stiff and grimy from the previous day and what I've been doing all day. It makes it a lot easier to work with and it just feels a lot better. homework I still can manage with my brain power being what it is. I go to a pretty advanced school which means that I have a pretty decent amount of homework. I have five classes which equals around five hours of homework every night. So it's quite a bit and I don't usually get everything done at night but I always manage to finish in the morning. Here I think I'm working on physics. It looks like physics from what I can see. I'm also making sure that I drink lots of water so that I stay hydrated all throughout the night so I don't have to worry about it in the morning as much. I know my pajama pants have changed. I filmed this on a different day of the week than the other video. It is still very relevant though. In this clip, I am just reviewing the Spanish. I have read this chapter before and now I'm using this wonderful app which is called a photo translator which I just use to take pictures of the passages and then it translates it so I can just make sure that I get all the details that I might have missed when I read it the first time. I promise I'm not cheating, I've read this chapter before. Probably twice. going to bed around 11 or 12.